What's happening, everybody? We got Miguel behind the camera, Tyler right here, Coach Tyler from Orange City Fitness Avery Ranch. So Miguel and I were talking back in the back about kind of feeling that upper body and what it should feel like with some of these exercises. And I feel like there's a lot of people, including myself, for a long time I was thinking, well, what what should my back be? How should you know? Is it is it uh, should I arch? Should I stick? You know, we say stick out your butt. You know, things like that. Um, and I want. I'm coming here today to give you a bit of relief on things. So let's talk about today about neutral spine. So basically every exercise you're going to do should be in a neutral spine. So a neutral spine means that nothing should be too curved up top. No, nothing should really be too much down low either. It shouldn't be either one of those. It should just be pretty much what you think is pretty straight. So in any exercise, try not to overthink about it. Try to think. It doesn't have to be like a curve. It doesn't have to be straight. Just think. So a little bit about your spine, your upper spine, and I think you know. I think some people know this, right? That upper spine come, kind of comes back. That lower spine kind of comes in. So this is kind of more your hips, and this is more your shoulders here. But uh, those curves happen, and they're natural. They should be there, but they shouldn't. You shouldn't be able to probably. You probably shouldn't be able to see them too much in person. So if I were to look in the mirror and I'm doing an exercise, if I can kind of notice one or the other, it's, it's probably a little too much there. So they should be there. It should look natural. Not, you shouldn't ever feel like, you know, maybe a coach might cue you a little bit to, to do a little bit, but I want you to have the confidence that it should just be a neutral spine, whether it be abs, something down low, your low back shouldn't be arching. Just think neutral, 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 and you won't do anything wrong. Now. One caveat with that is uh, sometimes we're doing something like a bent over low row, right? So we're doing low rows right here, and all of a sudden someone tells you to keep your chest up, and you're thinking, ah, oh, I, I, I can't even do as much weight. I, it's almost like all I'm thinking about is fighting, is fighting that, right? All I'm thinking about is just trying to, I can't, I can't even focus as much as I'd like to. And that's a good thing. Don't run from that. that that's... That's how you get results, right? So, so yeah, I can keep telling you to put that weight up, but if we can get you and you're feeling it right there, that tightness up top, that's a good thing. Go for that. That, that means you're feeling it. That means, um, that means we found a weak link, and if we can bit, the more you can build your weak links, the bigger your results are gonna be. So if you feel something like that, someone tells you to be tight right here, and you're thinking, God, all of this. someone tells you to be tight in your butt, we're about to do a video on that, but, uh, you're thinking, man, all I'm doing is thinking about that. Good, good. That means that means you found something. So remember, neutral spine, check yourself in the mirror. Don't curve too much, don't slouch too much, right there in the middle with everything, and you'll be taken care of. Thank you guys so much.